Imagine getting a free exotic on your character of choice. Imagine getting guaranteed legendary drops for activities instead of all these damn blues. Imagine if enemies respawned like they did before the patch that slowed down people leveling. They could have even offered a Santa hat skin, which would be right in line with all the lazy palette swap different shirt having skins they pat out the challenge cards with. But nope, Marvel's Avengers is a week away from having been out for four months and players are in tears of joy laughing at a campaign that still cannot be replayed, still two villains on rotation, the dailies are bugged, the dailies in your live service, and even if they were to drop in free exotics, the blues can have better stats. No iconic Marvel locations, one enemy faction, garbage matchmaking, abysmal player base, but worst and most perplexing of all, a terrible shop with ugly dollar store Avengers. 80 years of Marvel? No thanks, said Crystal Dynamics. Money is overrated, so cover up those women. Nothing bigger than B-cups, don't spend more than 20 minutes on those models, and don't let them use more than one emote at a time. You'd think it was parody. Is this meant as like a practical joke for a gift? Because it may be the best damn joke gift that has ever existed. I want to personally thank every other Marvel's Avenger shill that's making content for this game for refusing to highlight the blatant issues plaguing this game for months. It's instantly made me the only honest guy covering this game, while you hacks are busy covering for a company that charged people for a product they admit is broken. I fully understand that sometimes honesty might deny you access, but I'd rather be real and tell the whole truth than to be a feck boy. It's particularly hilarious to hear Super Rebel say, leaking is bad guys, it's not good for the community. But now, <laughs> now, Every video this dude makes is basically him talking about a Miller tweet. Miller, who tweets shit like, and I quote, Adam Badowski is a little bitch. Of course, he's entitled to say whatever the hell he wants about whoever the hell he wants, but damn, I'm only critical of this stupid ass game. And people in my comment section cry abuse because I guess developers only had 10 minutes to develop this game? I have no personal qualms with the, the weirdos that made this game. The quality of the game, though, is most certainly in question after I paid for it. Crystal Dynamics has spent a third of a year trying to fix this beta, and their bug fixes broke previous fixes that now require fixes. The fixes need fixes. You know how easy it would be at this point to make a case that the developers probably hate their jobs and want to be fired? And you're hyped for potential unconfirmed Black Panther content that in all realness is probably coming multiple months away from now? Y'all flipped the script so many times that you have now naturally arrived at, well, it's gonna be better. It's gonna be better soon. It's gonna be better. You're just rocking back and forth in a corner, right? Shit's hilarious. Allow me to take your ass back three months to when people might have cared about this game in the way of trying to see where it would go from here the, before the, the archers were thrown into our faces like, you guys looking for this? Hell no, nah, we weren't looking for that. You see all of this? You see all of this? Three months ago, two months ago. None of this is in the game. Merry Christmas. Do you deserve better? I think you deserve better. Does this game deserve your time? Even when they eventually release the content that will most certainly be buggy as hell, unless they giving you double what this game's worth in, I want to call them V-Bucks because I don't know if it's credits or units. Fuck this game. You know what I mean? If I were to give you one reason to be upset about this game, it should be that this game was in all likelihood the one opportunity that an Avengers game like this was going to be made in probably half a decade. I don't see this happening again in the next five years. I'm not telling you to be bad, I'm just telling you like it is. This should have been handed over to an Asian or Eastern company to handle. There would be a hell of a lot less foolish decisions, less missteps, more intelligent and surefire like guaranteed to please fans decisions that would have definitely secured or at least recouped the development costs for this game. But boy, 
defenders, I'm finally going to warn you. Think twice about commenting on these videos. How annoyed you are only fuels the fire driving me to keep paying attention to this hilarious, air quotes, game. Just because you haven't developed more than an eight-year-old and consider everything that isn't praised toxic doesn't mean it's actually toxic. And I'll be here if this game ever gets better or to throw the last bit of dirt onto the mound that, that is on top of that coffin and I'll be chiming in with all the things it was too stupid, stubborn, proud, and arrogant to include. Look at Fortnite, Iron Man, Wolverine, Thor, Doctor Doom, Storm, Venom, Captain America, Black Panther. When Fortnite opened up shop, they almost dare people not to buy something. You like Marvel? How about DC? Star Wars more your style? Maybe you're into The Walking Dead. You like Master Chief? Emotes with an emote wheel for quick access. Tabs so you have access to all of your emotes while you're in the game. And these emotes can be used on any character. They're not strictly for one character, like in Marvel's Avengers. This buy now, content soon approach to a game, oof. That's your social media right now. You trying to hawk this shit when it's not worthy right now. No pun intended. You may have people loving your crotch in their face, but they do not make up any respectable portion of the gamers who you need for this game to be successful. Please, come get this coal, Marvel's Avengers. To everybody watching this, thank you for your time. Merry Christmas. God damn it. Stupid D, you gotta hear me say that. Merry Christmas. Send me something IRL or online, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, damn. <laughs> Somebody got banned for real? <laughs> Someone got banned for asking a fucking question. <laughs> <laughs> damn, I just feel so slow compared to you, last you time. Shut the fuck up, DS! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it! Oh. I can't believe she said that! <laughs> 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 You just completely fucked over <laughs> Kyle. Jesus Christ! I got excited, damn it! <laughs> Man, this, was, this was real. I better just try to kill everybody like in one go. Mm. Wait, that's not how it works. <laughs> that's the wrong button. They're probably gonna see you. Like, how does it work? The, oh. Bitch. So, like. <laughs> When, when the timer goes down, just, oh fuck, <laughs> no, stay away from me. <laughs> he knows, no. <laughs>